What's up everybody, VR Gamer Dude here, and today we are going to war. That's right. So today we're going to be taking a look at Zero Caliber. Now this is an upcoming shooter. It doesn't come out until November 9th. I'm getting a little early look at it today, and I want to thank X Real Games for sending that my way. I got a chance to jump in last night, and man, let me tell you, it, it is definitely one of the better looking shooters out there, but... Does it hold up? Well, is it the next Onward? Is it the next Pavlov? I don't know. You guys be the judge. Let me know in the comments. But I'm going to put on the headset and we're going to dive in and check out Zero Caliber. All right, here we are, Command Central for Zero Caliber. And, you know, I've been playing this the last couple of nights, and I'm not hating on this game. So uh, I've been playing the single-player campaign. I have not checked out the multiplayer. Unfortunately, by the time I get to play, all of my buddies in the VR spies are usually fast asleep, considering they are six hours ahead of me. But we're going to go ahead and uh, just do a little bit more of the single player campaign tonight. I've been really enjoying that. But before we get in there, let's take a look at the lobby here. The lobby nicely laid out, stuff all over the place. We got these guys, man, they're having a pretty intense meeting here. Hey, I see you. Get off your phone. Pay attention to natural born killers, all right? And, and you, drop the iPad, all right? Y'all, you're in a staff meeting. Pay attention. Jeez. Uh, we got guy over here. He's up to no good. I see access denied. I, I got my eyes on you, brother. I know. All right. There's something wrong with you. So, uh, like I said, we do have our multiplayer portal, the single player there. Uh, we do have the shooting range, which is under construction at the moment. Uh, this is launching into early access on November 9th, which... Well, depending on when I put this video out, is either tomorrow or today. So uh, here we also have the armory. You can see all of the detailed weapons in the game. I mean, everything from little attachments to scopes to the different weapons that you can come in and buy. So let's say I wanted the sniper rifle here. I got 67 grand. That thing costs 4,000, so I could just buy it now, and boom, now I have the ability to test it out. Um, already bought the GE three here kind of liking that one um let's go ahead and cock that bad boy up and boom 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 but we're not here to play around in the armory we're not here to shoot dummies we are here to check out the game so let's go ahead and do that now um like I said, you know, it does have multiplayer. It's a little bit too late for any of my friends to be up playing. So we are just going to go ahead and continue on in the single player campaign. I've already completed the boot camp. I think you guys saw that one in a video by my good friend GameHard 4.0. So I'm just going to jump right in where I left off last night. Uh, I think I'm in the Chicago invasion. So let's go. Operation Bottleneck. All right, boys. On me. Let's move out. We're at the perimeter. Dahlia, how's Chicago looking? Not good. We'll have to go in dark. Here. Main mission is to prevent the Thalos uh -oh. from slaughtering the rest of the civilians. Can I pull that pen? They're nope. exceptionally nasty fucks. Negotiation is not an option. Thanks for the reminder. I was just about to try hugging him to death. Yeah, that ain't gonna work, buddy. But I don't know what she's talking about. Chicago's looking pretty sweet to me. This is like Island 359 and Onward had a freaking baby, man. So, really digging the Unreal Engine graphics in here. Uh, I, I, I tell you what, I love Unreal Engine in VR because it just always looks so damn good. So, all right, let's go ahead. We got some smoke over there. Looks like we got to clear the area here. I see the flaw, Loki. All right. Nice. Nice. Take him out, boys. Take him out. On me, maggots. Now, one thing I will say, the AI in the single player is just about freaking dumb. As you will see here in a minute, I can just kind of run right up on them. Uh, you guys don't even know I'm here. So definitely think single player versus multiplayer. This one's definitely going to be better in multiplayer when you've got some real players making real decisions. But it is fun to just come in here and shoot some dudes up. And look at the gorgeous graphics. Like you can see, I can just run right up on this guy. Hey, guy. Boom. You're dead. So, developers, 
fix the AI, because, you know, sometimes I don't want to play in multiplayer, especially when it's late at night like this, all of my friends are asleep, and, oh, oh, can't shoot the, uh, but see, it's like, he literally, I can just sit here, and he literally doesn't even know I'm here, so, <laughs> nice, yeah, way easier than I expected, um, but, you know, it is what it is. This is early access, so hopefully they will fix that AI. Because, uh, yeah, that's just a little, a little too easy. I'm on it! I'm on it! Oh, hell. Chopper's gonna crash. Get the sniper. Get the sniper, guys. Got a sniper up there. I see him. I see him. I'm working on it. Alright, I'm gonna get on the sniper. The fact that they did add a climbing mechanic, that is definitely high up in my book. Love it when I can climb things in VR. So let's see the snipe here. Boom! Love sniping stuff, man. Tell you what, though, this would be much better if I had my Pro Tube all set up. Should have probably taken a minute to do that before I started in on the game. I will say the sniper rifle is not that accurate. But, once again, that is one area that the ProTube really helps out with, is accuracy. So, right, I'm going to stow the sniper rifle, keep it. Go back to my machine gun here, and let's just storm them. Here you go, brother. All's quiet. All's quiet. Okay, let's take a minute to reload here. All right, boys, come on, let's advance. Oh, here we go. Nice. Let's go back to my snipe. Shot you right in the crotch with a sniper rifle at close distance, too. Gee, Bob, that had to have hurt. All right, now another thing I really like in this game the throwing mechanic is really decent. But once again, the AI is just dumb. So definitely, like I said, want to try this in multiplayer. My gun jam? Give me strength. Uh, there you go. Yeah. You deserved it. Because you're stupid. Cover me! Flanking! All right, guys, watch out. I just threw a grenade in there. All right, let's clear this warehouse. Cop called me, stop calling me a dry mouth, some bitch. To the left, to the left. No, where am I getting hit? Yeah. How the hell do they get this much of it? I don't know, man. The Tlaluki never lack water. It's the main reason so many people join them these days. 
worshiping an Aztec godlike lunatic is still better than dying of thirst, I guess. Yeah, you got it. Still unknown. They swear it comes straight from their god, Plaloc. All right, but you can't believe it actually comes from an Aztec god, right? Oh, uh, hell no, brother. We've yet to come up with a better explanation, though. Now back to the task. We're still searching for civilians. All right, come on, boys, on me. Firefight ahead of us. Might be civs. Permission to engage. Permission granted, Permission granted buddy. We've got civvies up here. Let's protect them. Your ground, fellas. Think of your families. What the hell? I thought we had no reinforcements. Take cover! Double check your shots. Civilians at the house. The Watch out for the civvies, boys. Watch out. Nice. Damn, Claw Loki. You stupid Aztec water god. Taking all our water. Talk to their leader. Might have some information. Friendly's inside. Hold your fire. Alright. It's going, boys. Where the hell are you? OSA. We're doing rescue. We're here to save you, bro. We thought that we were left to die. We had to fight, had to delay them. Our families get away. I, I've never killed before. Where did the other Tlaloki go? They're headed straight downtown, looking to take as many new thralls as they can. And they are not fucking around. Okay. If they find you, it's on now. All right, bring him. Bring it. Please, not again. Sometimes the gun accuracy is not the best as well. Um, another thing that's weird is the guns actually do react to objects, so sometimes that can knock your aim off. I got you. I got you. Try now. Moving out to luck. Give me street covering fire. To luck. I got him, buddy. I got him. Got it. Hold on, man. I'm coming. Good job, boys. What were you thinking? We'd be dead if not for you. Thank you. No need. It's what we do, bro. It's what we do. Soon. You better get going ASAP. All right. Form up on me. Ready, boys? 
head out. Over here. All right, come on, come on, come on. Hard pushing to Chicago. What the hell? Whoa! How cool was that? Nice. Boys, we gotta protect that purification plant. Let's do it. Alright. Gotta hold, boys, gotta hold. Alright guys, stay in the perimeter. We got an artillery strike inbound. Kill the Here we go, here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Nice. <laughs> Very cool. Yeah, they did. Feeling blind. Sorry, Liam the squad. I'd love to chat a bit more with you broke dicks, but we're moving out. All right. To save America. That's right, Classic America. Salt. You managed to be an asshole even during the apocalypse. Stay safe, brother. That's what I'm talking about. All right, big guy. You ready to continue? Well, no, not tonight. I think we are going to go ahead and cap it here. But man, let me tell you, you know, this one's definitely got some potential. Um, I, I, you know, the graphics are decent. The gunplay is okay. The single player AI definitely needs some work. Uh, can't wait to check it out in multiplayer. So like I said, the game officially launches on the 9th. And if you want to try it for yourself, I am going to throw a link for it down in the description. But for me tonight, guys, that's it. This is VR Gamer Dude, signing off, y'all. Peace.